Hello guys, this is Elkskins. I uh, am just uh, doing a little short video. Uh, I'm in the midst of uh, making a nice long one on this. Hold on. What do you want, Flash? Huh? What do you want? I knew what that noise was. It was him. Saying, human, what are you doing? Of course, he wants in. So, you know, this thing don't have spark. And, yeah, I could throw another coil on it, but why? Uh, I could be pushing all that snow and it lets loose. And I'd have a major mess on my hand because with that bottom crank seal it's not leaking but if with that journal being wore out it can start leaking at any time and it could actually drop the seal altogether i've seen it i've seen uh these twins with excessive but lower end pl uh, play and it's not pretty to keep an oil in them so, that engine there checks out okay from time being. So, I just thought I'd uh, give you guys a little thing. The trailer is done. Uh, it's uh, got the tires put on it, greased. I will have to take the tires off and uh, space up the... Uh, wheels but for temporary that's it'll be fine unfortunately if i get this thing done i may end up having to use that trailer for the snow because it's how i cart uh the gas can the uh oil and all that i cart in a wagon and my big wagon needs bushings and it's uh has stuff in it and i'm not taking that four-wheel wagon out no way but uh that uh little cruddy looking wagon even though it's all redone it it'll get used hopefully this coming this week it is sunday uh and the snowstorm's supposed to start tuesday evening in the morning, I'm going to go get spark plugs. My other tractor is running a little weird, and I know why. Uh, the spark plugs are carboned up. It'll cut in and out uh, when it's warming up, but once it's warmed up, it's fine. But uh, I've had it happen before, and that's what it is. So, and this thing does the same thing. I'm sure, because it's wore out too. But, uh, that other engine, spark plugs look good. But, they're still getting new ones. I've got to drain this engine out on oil. Uh, and I got a bunch of other work to do. I got to pull th this thing all apart. Uh, get the flywheel off. Get the starter off. So... You know, I'm going to do what I can tonight and then fi hopefully finish it tomorrow. So, let me get to work and uh, when that big video comes out, I'll show you. It's probably going to be about two, three hours long, if not more. So, I'm going to fair warn you guys that it's a big video. So, and it's not going to be actual wind wrenching on the machine. It's going to be on the engine, how I uh, am doing it. So, all right, guys, I'll see you when I uh, get this thing tore apart and back together. 
So, all right, guys. Talk to you later. Bye.